View and go. Check it like a loggle. There's quite a few uh, suggestions in here that I would offer you, but one of them obviously is in my hand right now. It would be a, a, a mild cigar I would go with. This is an 858 Fuente. It has a Cameroon wrapper with Dominican filler, which is a very mild cigar, but you'll still get enough taste to where it won't be too bland. Uh, there's quite a few others in here that I would go to. Cuesta Ray, Montesino, the Rocky Patel Edge Light. I would go with something light. Uh, that would be my first uh, thing I would want to tell you. If you were to say, well, Greg, I smoke cigarettes, I smoke pipe tobacco, I chew tobacco, but I haven't gotten into cigars, I would probably bump you up to a medium body cigar since you can handle nicotine. So there'll be quite a few cigars in here uh, that I would go to, but one of my favorites for a beginner is the 858 day. Generally, you don't want to inhale your cigar. There are some guys out there that do, and I think that uh, they're putting too much smoke into their lungs, so I, I don't think it's a good idea. Uh, you're just you're cutting the you know you're cutting the cigar if you don't know what you're doing I would cut it for you there's a whole way of lighting it correctly toast in the end you know and we'll do that demonstration here in a moment but it's it really comes down to rolling it in your mouth you're, you're taking a hit you're taking a good puff you're keeping it around your palate your taste buds and you're blowing it out there is no reason to bring it into your lungs it's it's really de dedicating yourself a half hour, 45 minutes, an hour of just you, your cigar, maybe a book, yeah. the radio, a good friend, a sports show, I don't know what, but it's, you're supposed to take your mind away from everything else while you're smoking your cigar. You're not supposed to be sitting there thinking about what do I gotta do next yeah, after yeah. I'm done with the cigar. So it's, it's supposed to be a relaxing point, like a break for your day. Mm -hmm. I think, you know, overdoing them, you kind of tend to start maybe getting a little addicted to it you know and and I don't want to always be thinking I need a cigar and I got to carry one in my pocket everywhere I go so so I try to limit what I'm doing like I said once again I want to be around for a while with these so so we all know yeah we all know smoking's not good for us but stress is not either so smoke a cigar and get rid of the stress when you're on Oceanside be sure to stop by the cigar grotto and say hi to Greg the Cigar Grotto is located at 220 North Coast Highway in Oceanside, California. This is in the heart of downtown, and Greg can be reached at 760-722-1602.